Ah, oh, the pain's unbearable. Pretty much all the time. That's because your gallbladder's irritated. I recommend we remove it. Will that stop the pain? Yes, and it's not a necessary organ, so you shouldn't have any complications afterwards. <sighs> Great, can we do it now? That's the thing. We used to be able to perform procedures like this right away, but recent legislation now requires a waiting period. <sighs> How long? 24 hours after you have an ultrasound. But I'm in pain now. It could be worse. In some states, you have to wait 72 hours. And if you're a minor, you'd probably have to live with that nagging gallbladder your whole life. Oh, there are just a few more stipulations before we can perform your procedure. What? What else? First, you need to watch this video oh. so you can make an informed decision about whether you really want to remove your gallbladder. Are you scared, panicked, and alone? Are you considering having your gallbladder removed? You may think you have all the facts to make your decision, but what about what your gallbladder wants? At the National Institute for Gallbladders, we're the advocates for your organs and tissues, and we can help you make decisions you're not smart enough to make on your own. I'm quite sure I want my gallbladder removed, and I do not want to watch this video. I know you say that, but legally, we need to go through this process. I'm also going to administer an ultrasound so you can see your gallbladder and its development. What? Oh, God. God has a plan for your gallbladder. And there are options that are healthier for both you and your organs and tissues. Oh, this is really uncomfortable. It might not make you feel better to hear it, but some patients require ultrasounds that are much, much more invasive and uncomfortable oh. than what you're experiencing right now. If you know what I mean. Oh. You don't have to look at the screen if you don't want to. It is your choice. But legally, you do have to listen to a detailed description of what I see. This here is your gallbladder. It may look like a peanut or a cashew, but actually it's made up of millions of tiny little cells. This is ridiculous, all right? I'm in pain right now. I just want this out of me. Why is this ultrasound necessary? It's the law. Now, let's get back to my graphic description of what I see going on inside your body. These here are gallstones. That's what's causing you the pain. I think I need to find another doctor. Believe me, you're not going to find any licensed medical doctor to perform a gallbladder removal without going through these steps first. You could have avoided gallstones if you just made healthier choices to begin with. I realize that, okay? I know I shouldn't have had all those chili cheeseburgers and, and waffle fries, but I just, I never thought this would happen to me. Face it. If you slut it up long enough with pork pies and cheese fries, you will develop fatty deposits that cluster around your gallbladder. Please finish this video. And then you need to visit a gallbladder crisis center for counseling and so you can learn about alternative options. Gallbladder crisis center? Do those even exist? Not really, but it is the law. In the meantime, you can read this. The miracle of a gallbladder? What to expect when giving up your gallbladder to a loving home? Really? I'm not going to give advice in one way or the other, but if I don't see you again, I will assume your gallbladder has made someone without a gallbladder very happy. Now if you'll excuse me, I need to see another patient who's deciding whether he really wants to have a mole removed. <laughs> I just finished freshman year. It's not the right time for me to keep a mole. Do not play a bassoon.